it has been a really long time since I have made a video. This is going to be a little bit different, this one and the next few. Um, Josh and I actually came down with COVID. And talking uh, wears me out. It, um, it is quite hard for me to talk. I run out of breath. Um, I'm no longer testing positive, but I still have the, the whatever side effects of it. Um, it has done damage to my liver. My liver readings are very, very bad. And uh, my iron is critically low. My iron um, is 4%. Um, technically, they should have given me uh, a transfusion, but they didn't. So I don't know, but I don't have any iron pills. So I didn't think in a month's time it would go down that fast, but it did. So I'm mostly just resting, sleeping, recovering. So, um, I'm not going to really talk a whole lot during this video, um, or the next one. This is a video for, as you can see in the title or the description, this will be uh, Dr. Lee, DTLI contacts. Um, one set, I have two sets from them. One set was a blind box. I got to choose a theme and I chose one theme and they sent me um, five pairs of lenses. And the other um, round from them, the first round actually, was I got to choose again um, A or B and I chose one and they gave me uh, the lenses that go with that too. So I don't actually know what each lens is called, if they're called something different from what the packages say because I didn't choose them myself. So I will attempt to find the links for the actual lenses. And in the meantime, I will just tell you what the bag says, just in case I can't. Um, so mostly I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna do one for Color CL because I have the entire, um, almost the entire super moist or ultra moist uh, line to review. And um, while I still don't feel 100%, I, I probably don't look as sick as I actually feel, but I, I feel really bad. Josh feels really bad. He's vomiting. I've got more of the exhaustion, body aches, nausea, and can't breathe. Um, but uh, I don't feel 100%, but I don't want to leave these companies hanging. They sent me this stuff before I got COVID, before I was able to make the videos. So I owe it to them to do the reviews for them while I might not be able to speak. I'm going to do them in order from favorite to least favorite as always. And all this will go for Color CL as well, but I'll repeat it just in case. Um, so to start off with, I'm just gonna show the lenses and I'm gonna read what it is and then move on to the next. I'm not going to really give a uh, feedback, um, just note that I do them in order from best to worst, not best to worst, but my, my favorite to my least favorite. And, um, let's just get started. So these say Himalayan green, and obviously these are my favorites because I always start off with my favorites. This is Venus green. I actually think I like these better than the first green that I put on, but it's very close. This is Vision Gray. It's gray, 
but it has a pinkish tinge to it um, that's not really visible when you put it on. So I've got hair in my face. Um, this is far more pigmented with way fuller coverage than I expected. I absolutely love these lenses. These are so pretty. I would kill for eyes this color. They're nice and zombie, <laughs> which is what I like. In comparison, these are icy gray. These also have good coverage, but not as much as the other ones. So they're all beautiful lenses. I love them all, and I would be happy with any of them. Um, but I do prefer the other ones over these. But these are still pretty. They're just not as zombie. So if you want a more natural gray, this is probably a, a better bet, I would say. Egypt blue. I do want to say that Dr. Lee is really stepping it up. Their lenses are becoming really, really, really beautiful. And the detail is getting even better with each round that I get. And I typically don't like blind boxes, but I am super happy with uh, pretty much every lens I have received from them. These are called Girl Tear Blue, and these are gorgeous. They are different shades of blue with a white highlight in the corners there and a dark purple limbal ring. This is Venus Violet, and it's got a purple ring with a grayish color in the middle. These are, oh my God, so unique, in my opinion. <laughs> so, these are more than they appear. It looks like just pink lenses with hearts in the middle, which by the way, these are called spade pink. But um, when I tried them on, I was like, my vision is really dark. I couldn't figure it out because a people hole is not small, but it turns out in the center is a screen. It's a black screen lens, which helps, I guess, blend it into your eye color. Now these rotate um, as anything with a shape, you know, they tend to kind of move, uh, which sucks because you can't really see it and you're going to walk around all wonky. but. For photos, definitely, and if you keep an eye on it, these are so awesome. 
I have never seen these lenses ever and I think they are cool as hell. Last but not least, these are Mia Brown and for brown, these are gorgeous. They look very hazel, but also very natural. So my real eye color is there. So there's not a huge difference, but these are definitely prettier than my eyes. So those are the last pair that I have. Get off of my cat's trying to leave with my contact lenses. Um, that's the last of them. They are all so, so, so beautiful pretty realistic um, for the natural colors, very comfortable, very moist, and the company, again, is an awesome company. They were so patient with me and so great and wonderful. Highly recommend them. Would not lie to you guys about companies I don't recommend, but I have three favorites, and they're Mocha Queen, of course, Color CL, and Dr. Lee, so you can feel safe ordering from any of these. I, I definitely do stand by them, and uh, as you can see, these lenses are all very, very gorgeous, and um, gosh, contacts have come such a long way since I first dreamt of having contact lenses, and they were such a far away, unreachable goal, and now look, look at this, look at how easy it is. To change your eye color to something that you can be happy with or just play up with your look you know you don't have to be unhappy with yourself to want to change your eye color um, but anyway I'm gonna cut this short I've got an inhaler I've been sucking on between every take or every pair um, but uh stay safe out there you guys stay healthy um, COVID is no joke and I'm vaccinated didn't matter I mean, that doesn't stop you from getting it, but it didn't stop me from getting really, really bad side effects either. Um, if anything happens, I'll keep you guys updated, but fingers crossed I get over this soon. Anyway, stay tuned for my Color CL video, and I will see you guys then. Take care.